The next letter in simple process is M, which stands for manually brushing the restroom floor, which is optional. If an area of the floor or grout line is particularly dirty, we'll use the squeegee head brush or the mohawk grout brush to scrub it. To use the squeegee head brush, grab the vacuum wand from the system and flip the squeegee head so the brushes are facing down and scrub the floor. Pay particular attention to areas around toilets, urinals, and sinks to remove embedded soils and odor-causing bacteria. The wand-mounted mohawk grout brush can be used to scrub grout lines, removing stubborn soils that are not only unsightly, but can also be a haven for bacteria. Simply follow the grout line, scrubbing problem areas as you go. The squeegee head and mohawk brushes can also be used to scrub problem areas while you are vacuuming the floor during the extract and dry step of the simple process. Simply flip the squeegee head over to scrub stubborn soils, and then flip the head back over again to continue vacuuming. Usually, after several uses of the brushes, floors and grout lines will be clean enough that the step can be eliminated. Once the floor has been brushed, we're ready to move to the next step in the simple process. The next video covers the letter P, which stands for Pressure Wash and Rinse the Restroom. 